Hello again. How are ya? Are you alright? No, we're worried about the old Friday, aren't we? Because what I read was with the storm pier, eh? Well, there's ever the, the, everything's been blown everywhere, eh? Everyone's been bl- every, everyone everything's been blown at Christmas, isn't it? Have you do you find that that everything gets blown at Christmas? <gasps> So I'm worried about it. It's being unsettled, and of course, because there's because we have reports of some more cows being blown across the fields, didn't we? And beans and everything, and with all these lorries swaying side to side, the those big ones, the B and M lorries, were there. Have you seen how big they are? Eh? So what with that, you see, what with the storm here, and then the getaway on the Friday, well, road time and, and I've been having, well, I've been having panic attacks. Oh my God, what's going to happen? I, I do, I'm so worried. I, I don't know how we're going to cope. Ooh, I hope that we're just going to get through trouble free. Now the other thing that happens, I, well, I'll be going on a bit. But the Friday night, for road sign and I, it is the worst night of the year. And you know what? Because I had that with me bottom in the air, didn't I? My bottom, I, it gets, it get you, you get these, all of them out, out and about, getting up to no good, eh? Because it's that mad Friday that they await. And what, happen- and what happens to us, like, eh? Well, Roadside gets his pole turned, like no one's business. And, of course, he feels all over the shop. And he's green under the gills, by the... Because you get these people, they forget the trumpet jumping Christmas trees. They like t- putting their hands on his pole, turning it around. And I'm like, oi, you! Who do you think you are with your hands on Roadside's pole, eh? Get it off, eh? Oh, you, you don't, excuse me, but that is not the dumb thing. Anyway, and of course what happens to me is, well, I normally get a good kicking, eh? I'm there, I'm on me, I'm just trying to help the drivers and get everyone food up. And then uh, you get these drunks coming up, and then, uh, last time I got a kick in the bottom, and then my bottom was... Well, it was exposed all night. Oh, you should. And, of course, it was exposed to the elements, weren't it, eh? And, of course, by the by the time the night ended, there was all kinds of things up it. And I just thought, oh, my God, that eat someone even put a brick up my bottom. Can you imagine? And I couldn't get back up. And also, the worst one was when they picked me up one year these drunkards and I think it was round by it was somewhere it was somewhere in Croydon yeah that's right and they picked me up and they put me on top of this Christmas tree can you imagine and I was like a fairy on top of this Christmas tree with this thing up my bottom this sharp thing and I couldn't move I couldn't be, and I learned not a right nana, didn't I? Because they put fairy lights on top of me, and then no one came back for me for a few days. I didn't get back to the depot and roadside. Oh, he was so worried. He thought that he thought that I was done for. You see, but he told the supervisor, and they just said, "Well, there's nothing we could do for him." So I was left on top of this Christmas tree blowing in the wind, being blown on Christmas, eh? Like normal. And it was most disconcerting, eh? I just was all over the shop, what I? And it was like, well, someone said that, that I looked like an angel on top of the tree with the fairy lights, you see? But I didn't, it, well, it, that weren't funny, was it, eh? Because they had a laugh at my expense, didn't they, this lot? So I'm dreading Friday night. Oh, I've got anxiety about it, eh? I can't pump my nerves. Because they're bad enough as it is, you see. 
But then it's just going to be more the same, eh? And what would the storm be like if I get put on one of these trees? Will it be like this all night? I'm going to feel sick, and I? So I don't know. What with that, you see? What with the Christmas thinking that I'm going to be a fairy? And being blown? Well, no, it sounds like... It's, I don't know. I'm a bit worried about it all. And, um... And then who knows what's going to happen in 2024. Well, I'm sure I'll see before then, but it sounds like 2024 is the rise of the superficial intelligence in it, eh? And then it's going to be all over the shop, isn't it, that one? You watch, it'll back up. They think they got it all sorted, these scientists, but it'll back up. You mark my word. You heard it here first. Uh, You watch. You watch. Come... Come the, come the January when they switch on those systems, you watch it in the black wall. I'm telling you, it'll be all over the shop, won't it? Hey? Anyway, all my aches and pains and all they're coming back. Oh, so, oh, so it, the Friday night was well, say a prayer for me because, oh, my bottom's had enough over the last year with the potholes and it and at the back of the van. So it be sliding over the stage underpass. It's had a right good go. So I don't need any any none of these drunkards having a go at it, do I? Alright, then we'll take care.